Hello everybody, good evening and welcome one, welcome all to another edition of Andar Plays and it is Star Wars month and we're going to be playing Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order but there's going to be a bit of a twist um, for this Star Wars month. Um, this is not going to be Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. It's going to be a bit of a surprise and I'm going to show you guys exactly what I mean by that right now. You guys are gonna love this. I guarantee you, you're gonna love this. Look on with bated breath and see who's here, boys. It's Papa Waiter. It's Waiter. It is Waiter. That's right. It's Star Wars Fallen Jedi special. It's gonna be Darth Waiter mood. That's what it's gonna be. It's gonna be Darth Vader, guys. We're gonna be playing Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order as the alternative history of Darth Vader. <laughs> Let's do it. So, uh, we're using a bunch of mods, uh, one of which is this cool reshade mod that adds so much atmosphere to the game. That's right, we're playing Vader! Vader! Yeah, so uh, I thought, you know, with all the mods that are available for Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order and how, as amazing a game as it is already, I thought we'll basically load up a Darth Vader mod along with a whole bunch of other mods that change gameplay quite a bit and then we're gonna have a fun time. Um, Hello, what's... Oh, hello, sir. Waiter. Well, uh, the story itself doesn't change much, mind you. Um, in fact, nothing changes. It's just that the character model is Darth Vader. And we're gonna pretend like we're badass Raider. That's the idea. <gasps> yeah, can you imagine Raider running away from somebody? Mark well and listen. Master, trust only in the Force. <laughs> Turn this up. Yeah, something's going on. So this is basically without the reshade, and this is with the reshade. Move out and line up. Without reshade. Contraband and space. With reshade. A lot sharper, uh, better lighting effects, etc, etc. Without reshade. With reshade. So much better, right? It's just so much better. Sharper, uh, better effects overall, better lighting. Yeah. But it is really hard on the processor. Uh, it does push your graphics card and your processor quite a bit. Um, so you might want to be careful about stressing your card out. But for short playthroughs and stuff, it's pretty good. You can also cap the frame rate to 30 instead of 60. So that you don't stress out your cards if you're, you know, playing on a workstation, laptop, or uh, have older generation cards. Look at how cool this is. This is the without reshade. This is with reshade. How awesome is this? Yes, second sister. Everything looks more realistic. Dangerous future. This reshade turned on. This is no common anarchist, but a devotee of the treasonous Jedi Order. Yeah, he's standing in the line. It's Darth Vader. ...to turn over this traitor will result in a... Look at the guy in the mask. He's probably <laughs> in, ...or everyone present shall face summary execution. This is not the Vader you're looking for. I think it's time someone came forward. This is a different alternate reality Star Wars. This is this is Vader who is being uh who's who's basically nice. He he went into the dark side, he came out of it, now he wants to be a good guy and here we are. Ships. Best in the galaxy. 
Then came the Empire. And engineers became scrappers. The workers? They just started getting worked. We all know the truth. We're just too afraid to say it. To the Empire, we're all just expendable. Yes, you are. <laughs> Look at this, a lightsaber. A lightsaber that crackles. I found the Jedi. We replace the voice as well, so there's more of a dude in a mask voice. Got a stowaway. Hey, you don't need to call this in. Quiet. This is TK-81. Uh, an intruder? Feel the power of the dark side of the force. Okay, let me just take a look at the temperatures. Yeah, they're kind of acceptable at this point. Uh, they're holding together, I think. Um, yeah, so this is without the reshade, this is with the reshade. You would notice how um, how much sharper everything is with the reshade turned on. Without it, it seems a bit foggy. With it, it's, it's, it's just way better, yeah. Um, yeah, so restricting the frame rate to 30, I feel, is the way to go. Um, that gives you an optimal look, um, and also temperature control, which is important for the health of your machine. So there is that. Uh, oh, let's take a look at my... Oh, look at how beautiful this model looks, man. Awesome. Let's take a look at my video settings very quickly. So I capped it to 30 FPS, a uh, set V-Sync. Yeah, everything is good. Um, I think uh, visually we are fine, I think. Yeah. So you can see, without width, the reshade just makes things look so much better. Even even on Vader's, um, even on Vader's suit, like, for example, um, this model, of course, combines the existing Cal Kestis model with the Darth Vader model. But look at, look at how different the reshade makes things. Just much more realistic. So let's go. Vader is going to be on steroids. I wanted to chop that right up. You hear that over the comm? A Jedi? Stay sharp. They won't get past us. A traitor, blast them. You'll pay for that. Will you? Can't see an enemy. Contact confirmed. Shoot to kill. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> way to rules, boys, way to rules. <laughs> I chose to rest instead. That's how I prepare. Something over there. Enemy! Enemy here! Waiters on, boys! By the way, we also changed the look and feel of the lightsabers. Boom! says Wade. Uh, so all the blades are like super cool now. Off with your brains. I wonder if I should install the dismemberment mod, but unfortunately the dismember mod seems, uh, sorry. The dismemberment mod seems to have a few bugs that it needs to uh, work out, so there is that. Oh no. Oh no. Ah! 
comes this way, I'm ready for it. You are not ready for the Lord of the Dark Side. Also, I'm Vader. I should just be force jumping all of this, but that's all right. You know what? We're not going to demand too much of uh, a um, machine, cyborg, android, human, hybrid dude who is an absolute past master of the force. <laughs> okay, so how do you evade? Oh, okay. Alright. La 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 Even with a blue lightsaber, uh, Darth Vader is like the king, man. Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you do, like the video, subscribe to our channel, and look at how absolutely awesome Darth Vader is. So big shout out to the modders who worked on this. They're absolutely awesome. Gotta move in between verses. Okay, what are you gonna do? Go, 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 go. Here. I'm ready for your trick. Ah! No. You shot the couple out. Know. Gotta get down. Ah! 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 Come on, Darth, you can do it! No! This is bad! Well, you've done worse, you know, as Darth Vader. Just saying. You've put people in worse predicaments, my friend. Whee! Okay. It's just different, you know, playing this game as Darth Vader instead of Cal Kestis. Uh, yeah, it, it, I don't know, it just changes the vibe so much. Remember, this is Darth Vader's alternative history. Remember that. This ain't the real Vader, folks. This is Darth Vader alternates. He's way cooler than the real Vader. I guess. Um... Come on, let's go. I don't know why. There was a bit of an input lag there for a moment. Run! Run, Wade Machine! That's right, you can do it. Okay, yep, there we are. Alright, let me just check something, guys, very quickly. Yeah! Okay, capping it at uh, 30 frames per second was actually very good for recording. So this is this is just fantastic. I like it. I like it. Um, the video will also be basically 30 FPS. Oh. 
Come on, buddy. Take a shot. Yeah, Redeemed Waiter is not as uh, powerful as Dark Waiter in this particular timeline. He's basically growing stronger, better, etc, etc. Getting there. Whee! Ho 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 That's right, Waiter's getting redu uh, rescued by a Jedi. Come on. Oh no! Boom. Face your master. Look at how cool that is! It's so iconic -y. Going somewhere. I recognize that stance. Perhaps you've had some training after all. Who's your master? Padawan? Someone I killed, perhaps? What Jedi gave their life so that you might live? seem to be doing just fine. Yeah, the force doesn't seem to work very well against her. Okay, the game is basically making me stagger and run out of stamina. Yeah, my force power is not gonna work uh, against her. Can't escape. <laughs> I am still Darth Vader. This is the price of your arrogance. Well, you seem to be losing your HP just fine, despite being an Inquisitor.
cool. Nice getaway. Dart, your lightsaber. Okay, shut that thing off and grab some seat. Thanks for the help. Who are you people? My name is Sir Junda, and this is my captain, Priest Rytus. How you doing? Yeah, the man is my ship, but you better pay attention to this lady here. So, who are you? Cal, Testus. Who was that back there? An Imperial Inquisitor. She's a Force user hunting Jedi survivors. And now that she knows who you are, she will not stop until she destroys you. How do you know so much? Uh, why'd you help me? We track Imperial communications. We heard the Inquisitors were heading to Brock. So we made our move. Oh, yeah? What's the bounty on Jedi these days, anyway? That's gratitude for you. Look, I get it. You've been surviving on your own for so long that it's impossible to trust anyone. Yeah, well, I think Sith turned Jedi would be more valuable, right? But this In is bounty hunting. ...than just surviving. But what? Like rebuilding the Jedi Order. You too? Anybody else? Oh, we're not good enough for you? The Jedi Council? They're gone. Oh. So I'm all you've got. Captain, set a course for Bagano. Aye, aye. In the meantime, try and relax. Go, you're safe. For now. Cool, isn't it? I love I love this modded version uh, of the game. It is just so good. Find your destiny. Come, come. You were talking in your sleep, but weirdo. <laughs> Look how nice this mod is, man. It's beautiful. I mean, that is wowee. That is awesome. That is so cool. Oh yeah, that is awesome. Oh, uh, let's see if it can actually zoom in. No, the camera... Yeah, okay. Right, can I get like a zoomed in zoom in? Okay. I need light. Uh... Oh yeah, we can do that. We can do that over here. Yeah, I think we can get like a... Whoa, very cool. Very, very cool. Yeah, and without the uh, reshade, you don't get the kind of brightness and sharpness that you do otherwise. Very nice. Look at how stylish he is, man. Very cool. Okay, so what the heck am I doing here? By the way, another mod allows us to walk and run really fast uh, in these areas, so that's pretty cool. Darth Vader playing the banjo! <laughs> Darth Vader plays the banjo. <laughs> this is so cool. I wrote it years ago. You touch an object and witness events connected to it. You feel its history. It's an echo and the force from the object. Not many Jedi have that skill. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi. 
but not anymore. The whole vibe changes, doesn't it? I mean, Cal Kestis is like a mere Jedi, like oh. a character. You replace that with Darth Vader, and the whole thing takes on a life of its own. It takes on a flavor of its own that you just wouldn't find anywhere else, you know? Listen. Something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but my connection to the Force is damaged. When I meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. And it's like I'm back in that moment when you survived, Cal. Yeah, I came back from the dark side. Ooh, no. ooh. Not anymore. We're coming up on our destination. Right, now that all the, you know, the movies are done, we're gonna get back to some saber whacking. A Jedi I knew discovered it before the Purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists? No. So, what's the plan? We you hide out here? We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But Look at how much difference Reshade makes here. This is without Reshade. You should meet. And this is with Reshade. Look at the difference, man. It's like night and day. Amazing! I mean, the difference here is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Okay, uh, I'm just gonna go check the temperatures again. All good? Yeah. Everyone here want to see any me. How's the recording coming along? I think it's pretty good. Yeah, you guys might see me uh, shift, you know, all tab every now and then. There might be some screen flickering. If there is, please don't mind. Oh, 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 wow, Darth Vader. Look at how cool that is. Very cool. Jump evade. I guess it's contextual, yeah. Very nice. Good. I'm getting the hang of it. Let's go down here. Guy. Yeah, take a look at this. This is without the reshade. This is with the reshade. Just see how much difference you get, you know, in detail and texture and everything. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I don't think we can. We we don't have the power to affect what happens here. <laughs> I love how smooth the animation is. I mean, the the physics on Darth Vader's cape is not perfect, but it's just so good. I big, big shout out to the mod creators, man. They do some fantastic work on these mods. And the fact that they do it without pay, they put their hearts and souls into it, is just a testament to how amazing, you know, game mod, uh, game item creators are. This looks like a safe place to meditate. Just need to focus my mind. Yeah, you also need to stop jumping off of distant cliffs, I would say. Hello, save point.
okay, can we leave now? Oh, R is rest, okay. I need to be careful what I'm striking out here, but... Hey, BD-1. I'm Cal. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi, I think. Hold on. You, you know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait, hold on! Did you just slice that? Thanks. That's the Vault Seer mentioned. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. All right, thanks for the objective reminder. Okay, good, nice, okay. Good, okay, how do I get out of here? Come on. Right, can I skip this tutorial? Oh, for crying out loud. Thank you. Okay, I kind of came that way. Go down here, go in over there. Yeah, I climbed up this way. I'm not entirely sure where you want me to go. Like, that would be the save point, which is great. I'm pretty certain I can jump over here. I said something over here. Yeah, I wish there was a way we could get over there and fight that thing. I have tried so many times to get over there, but you you just can't. You just can't get over there to fight that huge monster. Um, afterwards, I think there's like a leviathan of some kind in that area, which is absolutely ginormous. It's, it's amazing. It really is. That's a really good bug. I am Vader! There shall be no mercy. It was after boggling eggs in the pack fought back. No way through here. Guess that's why BD1 warned me. Alright, maybe I'll listen to you next time. Okay, so why did you bring me here? I mean, BD1 is the one that brought me here to begin with. No, I don't believe I can jump that gap no matter how much I try. Any ideas? Gotta get across this gap somehow. <laughs> Is it point? <laughs> Whoa! How'd you know that would work? Okay, let's save over here. Uh, we'll just escape quickly. Lock from the other side, okay. Careful over there. That doesn't look safe. 
Says the guy who's... Yeah, the scrapyard. Okay. Says the guy who's basically tiptoeing on it. I think that's all of them. Oh, let's break some of the furniture because, you know, the animals were clearly dangerous. We have to leave that impression that, you know, the animals are really, really deadly, dangerous, terrible creatures. We just gotta leave scorch marks everywhere because that is the way of the force, okay? I said it. I'm Dot Vader. I'm the chosen one. It shall be so. Hello! Use this room for storage. We can have food and supplies. I don't think you needed the force echo to realize that. I think all the pots and pans would have pretty much made that quite obvious, I'm gonna say. Uh... Hello? Hey, that was pretty brave. You okay? Ooh. Wait, I can help you with that. You let me? Okay. <laughs> Annie, he used to love droids so much. Dear, dear Annie. Busted, but... Before he embraced the dark side, killed his wife. You know, destroyed an entire republic. Murdered a lot of kids. That's what he did. The chosen one. The vault. Yeah, that's where I was headed to. Okay. Well, first we gotta figure out a way out of this place. Hmm. Oh, the things we must do. Oh, 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 okay. Let's see. I want a more Darth Vader y color. We'll go with uh, that. Yeah, I'm barring campaign. Sounds good. Yep. Looks good to me. Hold on, I wanted a picture of that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Very nice, good. Are these pictures actually being, uh, are these pictures being recorded somewhere? Let me check. I certainly hope so. Um... I don't see them being recorded anywhere. Uh, that is Bioware. Star Wars EA? But it's got to be recorded somewhere, right? Star Wars screenshots. Um... Jedi Fallen Order... I'm not sure, man. Where does it store the screenies? Hold on. Let me check. Users, um, app data? I don't see that written anywhere. Where where does um 
Where does the game save its screenshots? able to find that out though where, where where those things are stored i'm pretty sure when i tap um f12 the game is saving the screenshots it's just electronic arts I don't know where it saves it. Hold on. Uh, Star Wars uh, Jedi Fallen Order screenshot. Yeah, lo location. Yes, 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 yes. In SW game? Where is this? Guys, I don't see it. Where is where is the Where is the where is such a folder? I cannot see it. Ah, oh, I got it. Okay. Config, no. Crashes, no. Logs. I don't see it. I don't see any uh, screenshots being saved here. Oh god, all those cool screenshots, I didn't get any of them. That that would suck so bad. Yeah, there is no screenshot directory here because when I save this, for instance, it's not there. So where, where am I supposed to go? Okay, the game is giving me mixed pictures here. It says they're all saved in different places and I just can't find it. Where where are they saved? My games pictures. Look, I know that the game is saving it somewhere. It's definitely saving it somewhere. I just can't seem to find... Oh, I got it! God, it's in the game folder! Oh my goodness. Oh, what a pain in the backside. Hey, sorry guys, that's such a pain in the backside. Yeah, I was trying to find that out, and then I paused the video over there. I uh, hope you guys will uh, skip as required, but... Yeah, that was such a BS. It, 
the internet gave me wrong location, just BS facts being spouted everywhere. Uh, okay. So the screenshots saved with the F12 key were saved right in the uh, game folder itself. I didn't have to go anywhere else. On my own way out. Nonsense. Hello? Safe it, but this should work. Hello? Those vines look like they read somewhere. Hope they're sturdy. Okay, there doesn't seem to be anything much here that we have to worry about, so... Let's go. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Whoa, hey, Darth, Darth. You may be an ex-cyborg, but you're not a princess. Be careful. What the heck? Dude. Dude, dude, dude. There we go. Hello. Misa Darth Vader. Yeah, we would have arrived at the same place, though. Ah! Well, that wasn't good. Yeah, I'm all right. The dark side is strong with us. Uh, let's see. Him. Healing stem. We're full of surprises. Thanks, little droid. Okay, let's try this again. Okay. <laughs> Here, hop on board. Cool. Okay, I'm gonna try and customize a little bit over here. Uh, heels cow. Yep, that's Dorothy. All powerful Dorothy. Let's see if we can customize some nonsense over here. Oh, we can give him a different poncho, which actually clips the whole thing a little bit, doesn't it? Yeah, this poncho kind of clips him. Eh, it's not great. I'll take the original poncho. I like to keep that Darth vader -y look. Yeah, Darth Vader with a golden droid makes a lot of sense. The Mantis will, of course, be a golden color because reasons. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, I think we're good at this point. We are good. Let's keep going. Let's get some gameplay in. Never known a forgetful droid. Can't argue with that. Hello. Why would I want to cut that, though? Hey, a chest. Think the Jedi would mind if we grab supplies? Did you find something, BD-1? Okay, but even if I got that, where would I go? I would grab this, I guess, to go down, not to swing anywhere. That's where we need to go. I can feel it. Okay, good, good. Feel whatever you want. Let me change my camera, please, quickly. Thank you. <laughs> A bit of force required there, absolutely.
Yeah, falling down here is not going to benefit anybody. That's the same area that I was in the last time. Uh, this is just an elevated position. Bit unprofessional there, Darth, but uh, all done, all good. Okay, so we completed this. I was just looking at all the various places we can go to, come from, etc., etc. Uh, we don't seem to have way too many choices at this point. Yeah, BD1 is basically screaming, Go there! Go there! Please go there! And I'm like, okay. Oh, 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 oh. I don't think... You mapped everywhere we've been. Okay. I can't make it over there. We gotta find another way. Right. Yeah, I figured we can't actually run across the walls like that. BD says go this way. Hello! Good job. Where are you going? Did you find something, BD1? Poncho material. Okay. Customization. What did you get? Uh, that's a very white Darth Vader. Um, PC aside, I just don't think that would go very well. Leave it as it is now. Resting. I'm just I'm just gonna save the point and move on. This tool was used by someone eager to reach the vault. Imavedor! <laughs> I assume there's no point in going to those other places. Oh boy! Yeah, this this is this is gonna be great. Got him. Cool. Waiter, 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 waiter. Yeah. Waiter's awesome. I've never killed this thing on the first try, man. 
Yahoo, the dark side. Of course, I'm fresh out of stims right now, so... Anyway, we were doing something out here, uh... Before that idiot came in and, you know, blocked us. I don't have wall running as Vader, so... I'm gonna have to be a little bit surreptitious. Yeah, I can't go down that path. I just don't have the power for it. But we can meditate here. Uh, what do I get? Dash forward and uh, what? Jump while dashing to flip over the target instead. Can I see this ability? What? That is not bad. So, I would have to hold F. Okay. But I would have to jump in order to do that. Yeah, that's not automatic. Okay. go with life, or we can go with this dash strike. Let's go with life. The question is, where are we headed? There is definitely something over there. I'm pretty sure I cannot make that. I could jump down. There is that option. No, I don't think... Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, wow! Waiter did it. Awesome. Yeah, this guy is way better than Cal Kestis. <laughs> uh, um... Oh, that seems to be a bit on the pointless side, but it does let us get down, though. Alright, you do you. Scan whatever you want. Vader says no. Dude, this is just so much better than playing Cal Kestis. Let me just say, this is just so much better. Like, I just feel in the mood, you know? No wonder Vader is like such a cool character, iconic. It's just, he changes the whole vibe just by being on the screen. Hello. What am I even doing here? See something in there? Oh yeah, it's wall running. Hello boys, wall running. Try 
again. It's difficult, Master. Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but with persistence and the Force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Look how different this is, man. Do what you must to reach. Without reshade, with reshade. Just so much better. Okay. What do you want me to do? Wah! Okay. Good. Good. Again. Now, reach my position. I did it. Persistence and force is my ally. Just remembering all tricks. Aren't you basically the force? Ah, okay. Apparently that didn't work. I thought I could go all the way up because he's way there. Think you can show me that shortcut again? Yeah, it's right up there. Okay, first of all, how do I how the hell do I get there? Um probably through the other side. Hold on. Wait. Yeah, not through there. Wow, I made so many mistakes there, but good. Made it through. This area was used for meditation. I'm somewhat familiar with the Jedi Order. Okay. So what? Sorry, I mean... What am I supposed to do with that information? just feels so natural uh, with the flow of this whole area. It's just like, he's awesome. Yeah, I don't need to meditate there. I've already unlocked it. Let's go. <laughs> I see you. Alright then. What do we find? Okay, where do you want me to go now? It's probably an elevator. There's no point in going there though. Yeah, because I can't unlock that thing. Uh, there's no point in going this way. This is a rise, not a fall. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, the reshade makes a huge difference, man. Look at this. Washed out colors. Reshade. So good. Yeah, the sky is a bit bright, but that's what skies are. They are bright. But everything else just visually pops out to the point that you just go, Wow, this is awesome. It really is. Okay, where are we going next? You cannot face the might of the dark. <laughs> Whoa! Said all of you are dead, 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 dead. Okay, what is the point of being here? Right, you'll fall down and then go back to the froggies, I suppose. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that if I fall down here... No, it would actually take me back up to this place. Huh. Okay.
Fine. I mean, if I can find something cool... There's nothing there. That just leads... Yeah, that just leads back up. Yeah, over there. That's fine. I want to explore this side, just see if there's anything that I can possibly remember. Ah, okay. So I basically went this way instead of coming this way. Alright, fine. Uh, fine, fine, fine. Let's go. Come on, Darth. You can do it. I thought these dudes would be a problem. Ahaha! Ah, can you sense this? <laughs> yeah, sorry about your scalp link. But standing up to that bog rat? Pretty brave. <laughs> Something we can use? Yeah, just some lightsaber sleeves. We can't do anything over there. <laughs> Yeah, this is the shortcut that we kind of did not go into the last time. Oh, 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 oh. oh it's on. <laughs> We're not finished yet. Okay, okay, you probably would have won. Probably. Very nice race up this hill. I've not actually played the game this way before. Uh, I usually explore all the other spots, take my own sweet time. Whereas this time I just went with BDA and had such a good time with it. BD8, whatever. What is that? I wanted to destroy their offerings and I can't. Well done. Everything okay, BD1? Is amazing. Without reshade, with reshade. Pops, doesn't it? Oh. You alright, BD? Well done, whoever you are. Without reshade, with reshade. And gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Ino Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault, is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages 
and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zepho once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zepho homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. Little do you know, you speak to the one lord of the Sith. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. You know, I've been alone for a while now. By choice. Without any purpose, just hiding. Well, you did kill a lot of kids, buddy. Just saying. It's no way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Sierra was right. Maybe we're done hiding. Hey. You wanna meet some, uh, friends of mine? I don't know what you mean, but okay. I think we have to go back the way we came. I don't. Yeah, I don't think. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. They actually, maybe it's because the, I'm playing as Jedi Knight difficulty that it's a lot simpler. But yeah, I do feel the game is progressing a lot faster than before. What is this? Okay, nowhere that I want to be right now. But chopping that down doesn't give us any advantages. Does it? No, I don't think... No, there's nothing there. Okay. Going that way doesn't help immediately. That's not moving. Door is locked from the other side. Okay. My friend, it appears the Sefo had some interest in Dathomir. Strange. For such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. Well, not everything is peaceful, peaceful, you know. Like, even if it appears that way, it's not really so. Cool.
Should be a lot quicker than the way in. Uh, you mean if I go that way? Yeah, but I also want to explore this place over here. What is this place? I should actually come back here afterwards because I have no idea how to get up there. You know? Like, no clue here. Like, there's this thing over there that I assume you sh you ought to be able to get, but... I cannot get up there. For the life of me, I cannot. I've tried so many times, I just can't. Like, even if you go that way... Yeah, I don't believe you can either. Yeah. can't anyway, you just can't. Okay. Uh... There we go. Very good. Sense the echo. The Jedi used this place to study the sphere above. I can still feel the excitement. Yeah, but I still can't get up there, though. They're just not gonna let me climb that spot. See, even if I go that way, I don't know how to get up there. The only possible way I can think of is, like, double jumping, but even then. Or I'd have to pull that spear down. I can't do that the way I am right now. Very good. Thank you. Now, one of the lightsaber mods that I downloaded allowed me to make my lightsaber blade unstable like that, you know, like in, uh, you know, Sky Rise of Skywalker and the new trilogy of movies. It's actually pretty good. I like it. And uh, many lightsaber colors or whatever it is allows, uh, made the lightsabers uh, images much brighter than they are usually. So that's another advantage. That thing looks like it smells worse than Grease does. Got me. Okay, the evil boggy thing has my EXP, so that's something that I'll have to deal with. Just a moment, guys.
Right, let's get back to it then. I want to kill that thing before we stop for today. I don't know where we are going to respawn though. No idea. I'll respawn close enough. Come on, Darth. Let's go. Oh man, that was so close, we were so close to that. Yeah, I think I'm getting a bit greedy, I really am. I'm getting very greedy, that's the thing. I come so close to it and I'm like, no, let's get that extra hit in, and that just does not work. Okay, uh, let's do it again. This is embarrassing for Darth Vader, I'll say that much. But then again, this Darth Vader is the good one. And as we know in the Star Wars universe, the good guys always suck in the beginning. I'm dodging way too early, that's the problem. I'm just, I'm used to playing on a higher difficulty level. <laughs> where you have less time to dodge, and I remember that, and I'm playing in that style, you know. Yeah, but I'm not doing Vader fans any justice, straight up, right now. I admit it, as a Dorothy Vader, it's not great, but you know what, we'll do our best. Let's go again. I'm fairly certain there's actually an easier way to access that boss uh, later on, but I think you need like double jump for that. That's just rubbish. Just rubbish, rubbish right there. That just sucks. But anyway, that's that's a great way to, you know, wrap up a first video about this game and just but I am gonna beat it uh, before we stop. I don't care if I have to fight it like twenty times, I'm gonna win. I died so much to that boss. I was wondering if I could use the Vader mojo and just based on how amazingly we've been doing so far. Um, I can just plow through it, but clearly not, you know?
my goodness. Help me. Oh God, do not screw this up. Got it. Woo! Oh my goodness, with zero health too. Anyone? Glad to hear. Ah. Uh, wow, I would have like having taken it down to like the lowest HP and having my HP reduced so much to die at the last moment would have been really bad. Oh ho ho ho. Oh. Oh, this would be an amazing photo. You know, waiter standing next to the thing that he- Oh, the corpse dissipated! That just sucks. Yeah. I need to come back here to get, like, a bonus stim or something, but I can't do that right now. Is there any way up out of here? Yeah, there's a way to access this straight from the top, but I can't do that right now. Look at the illumination on that lightsaber. Oh my goodness. Uh, I could probably run like a part of that wall, but the rest of it would just crumble on my ass. No way. Yeah, even Vader is not magical, man. Hmm. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Okay. Uh, before we go up there, um, let's just quickly meditate. Let's look at the skill tree. That's right, we got more stamina, dude. We're like the cool Jedi. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> yeah, I think this. Yeah, this was the space, actually. Yep. Hi there. Seem happy. <laughs> Making a new friend. Yeah, I thought he would be there and I could like strike him with a lightsaber, but no, I can't. Okay, there's literally nothing I can do here, isn't it? It's uh, Yeah, with resh without reshade, with reshade. Look at how pretty that is. Absolutely beautiful. Um, I can't cross over either. Look at how pretty that is. Yeah, and Darth Vader looks great too. Like, without reshade, it's like totally washed out. With reshade, it's like a real life area, man. Awesome. I can't, I can't stop myself from showing that off because I like it so much. most of the enemies here. All right, let's go. You passed the test. So you knew about BD-1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? Get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Don't get out of there! Get out! That is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of patoli weed fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. 
Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of four sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. You can do it, Darth. You can do it. There we go. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order? I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. Dathomir Zepho, it's your choice. All right, that's it. That was fun, fun, fun. I've enjoyed this quite a bit. This particular series is absolutely amazing. Please. I love playing as Darth Vader. What? It's awesome. You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Well, I've been a bit busy hauling you around the galaxy. But you know, you could pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. When it's out there, you betcha. But when it's behind a comfortably thick wall of embarn glass, that's perfection. All right, I'll see if I can buy any. I think I found like one seed, right? It's starting to grow. Yeah. The mod to let you run in the ship is just so good. It's absolutely amazing. No, I like that. I like that sleeve just fine. Nah. Yeah, this is good. All right. Alright guys, I think at this point I'm gonna go ahead and take a break. I hope you guys enjoyed um, this edition of uh, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order during our Star Wars month brought to you by Razor Light Entertainment. We're gonna be back with episode 2 of this series. I think I'm gonna play it because Darth Vader's alternate fantasy story is absolutely amazing. But I will see you guys next time. That's all for this episode. God bless you all. I, please take care, you know, take care of your loved ones and everything. And I will see you next time. I'll leave you with Darth Vader in the sun. Dun, 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 dun. Dun 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 dun